Pandemics have occurred throughout history. The coronavirus of today, the bubonic plague, and the Black Death are some common ones. In this episode, we will be talking about a particular forgotten pandemic, the Spanish flu pandemic of 1918 to 1920. Nope. So what is the Spanish flu? Its scientific name is the influenza virus, easily transmitted through droplets made by people who are sneezing, coughing, or talking. The influenza virus is of avian origin, meaning it came from common birds, such as pigeons. It was called the Spanish flu because Spain was the first one to report the mysterious illness spreading in its country. Nobody knows where the flu originated. Scientists and historians say it came from France, China, or the United States. But what is known about the virus is that the flu's first case originated in the USA, where a person working for the US Army got infected. During the First World War, food was scarce. Many soldiers went hungry in the trenches, so they had to make do with what they had. They ate all sorts of food, from fleas who inhabit their trench coats, to frogs, rats, and pigeons. All of these creatures that they ate may potentially carry a virus, which is why most soldiers returning home from the war were infected with some kind of virus. When doctors around the world first reviewed the cases, they were dumbfounded. They were caught unprepared and had no antibiotic or medicine to combat the flu virus. So, they treated patients with different medicines that don't stop the virus, but at least are effective in some way. Medicines like aspirin and quinine were prescribed while masks similar to the one we wear now were produced. The hospitals started to pile up with the sick and dying. People of all ages can be infected. The virus is deadly with the aging and the children less than 5 years of age. The infection rate kept rising and rising as the virus mutated, making it harder for scientists to find a cure or slow it down. The death toll <gasps> kept rising. But in spite of this, the media was suppressed, meaning limited information about the virus was known. Nobody knew how many were sick or dead. In the end, the virus went away after every person it infected either died or recovered and developed immunity, making it one of the worst pandemics in history. Thank you for watching this episode. Please leave a like and subscribe to this channel.